addiction, depression, and the use of psychedelics. People get addicted to compounds, addicted to compounds like alcohol and other drugs, which I don't know because I'm not a chunky. And then there's depression. There's a spectrum of mental illnesses that centers on depression and makes people suffer. Their suffering is horrible. Physical pain can be born, but mental pain is so debilitating that the person, even the strongest of person, with mental illness is reduced to ashes. So, both of these issues have one common solution, a solution that is not legal. But however, with the current research, I'm, I confidently believe that in the following years, it will certainly be legalized, at least in the medical circles, because in other circles, if they legalize it, it could lead to abuse, for sure. Yes, I am talking about psychedelics, like LSD, psilocybin. These compounds can help you navigate your consciousness. They can help you transcend your addiction and mental health issues like anxiety. It's a strange world we live in. The government of our country bans non-addictive compounds like LSD and psilocybin, I know the reason, because it can cause visual hallucinations which are not conducive to social life and professional life, but they allow compounds like uh, alcohol and other drugs which really are addictive, so I don't know why they do it. I mean, certainly they are after your money, they are trying to milk money from you, maybe, I don't know. So, uh, so my point is, it's high time that we legalize these psychedelics, at least in the medical circles, because so many, so many millions of people in the world are suffering from mental health issues. And it's high time that we provide solutions because people, most of the people who commit suicide, in fact all of them commit suicide because of mental health problems, either it's anxiety, depression or other issues. So by the usage of psychedelics we can prevent them and we can save a lot of lives. Now there's one more thing I would like to add it with psychedelics is that once you unentangle from your addiction or depression or mental health issues you don't need you need not continue using psychedelics you can switch to a regular practice of mindfulness meditation that will regulate your mood and consciousness and well make you live a life that is peaceful and happier thank you